Hey, what's good, y'all? Uh, you know, I hope everybody's blessed. You know, I hope everything's going good. Uh, I just want to tell y'all about this dream that I had last night. Uh, the dream started off, or it was a lot of different things, but these are the things I can mainly remember. Um, I, where I started off at was I was in a living room, and it was a little dark in there a little bit, but it was a living room, and it was a lot of people in the living room, like around the floor. I was sitting on the couch, and uh, to my right was uh, this girl that I used to go to elementary with uh, named Anika. And uh, so she was on my right side or whatever, you know. We was just talking, kicking it cool. And, uh, you know, I gave her a kiss. And uh, and then I left out of there, and uh, I went to this other place. I went to this place that was, like, upstairs. And it was, uh, it was like this, you know, uh, upstairs place or whatever. And then it was, like, some people, people started coming up to me, and then they started telling me, this one guy, he came up, his name was Calvin, you know, he was, like, telling me about jobs and different things, you know, like, hey, well, you know, you can work, you, you working, you, you can work with me, you know what I'm saying, you work where I work at or whatever, you know, I was like, you know, uh, nah, I'm good, you know what I'm saying, I'm finna go, you know, play basketball and everything, he was like, man, he was like, man, you, you dumb, you shouldn't have lost, you shouldn't have kept, you should have kept your job, you know what I'm saying, he was like, you should have kept your job and still hoop, you know, and I was like, man, I was like, Man, what you talking about? He like, cause he was like, now you're not gonna be able to get there. And I was like, nah, nah. I was like, nah. I'm good. You know what I'm saying? I can ride the bus, anything. I'm gonna be able to get down there regardless. So I don't have nothing to worry about. You know, all I gotta worry about is working out and, and getting in, in shape, doing what I need to do. You know what I'm saying? To get to my tryout. You know what I'm saying? And uh, and y'all will soon see what that tryout is. I tell y'all. But uh yeah, so I'm rolling, you know what I'm saying? So I'm uh so so I'm like I'm like, nah, forget that. And then some other people came up and were saying the same thing. And I was like, Man, nah, I'm good. So I left from there and when I left from there I was like, Man, I gotta go home. You know what I'm saying? I felt like I, I gotta go home. And it was like nighttime, so I but I got on the freeway and it was light on the freeway, you know, like moonlight or something. It was light on the freeway, so I started uh, running down the freeway real fast, started running down the freeway, but it was just like, you know what I'm saying, like working out, like, you know what I'm saying, like, shoot, I got to work out, you know what I'm saying, this is the life I done chose, this is the, the path I done chose, so I'm working out, I'm running to the house, I'm like, I'm going to run wherever I go, I'm going to run, and um, so then, then the next part is I end up hanging out with Beyonce, you know what I'm saying, like hanging out with Beyonce, uh, and the thing was is that night, before I had this dream, you know what I'm saying, I asked God, you know, I asked him, what is it that he wants me to do, you know what I'm saying, I want to walk in what he wants me to do, I want him to guide me in my life, and, you know, show me exactly what it is that he wants me to do, and he's been doing that for me, he gives me specific instructions, you know, he talks directly to me, and gives me many instructions, and many instructions to give to the people, and, uh, so yeah, so the next part of the dream, so I'm, uh, and so that's what I prayed tonight, you know, so that's why I'm saying this is, you know, he's showing me my path, I believe. And, um, and like I said, pray for me in Jesus' name. So, yeah, so, uh, so yeah, so I'm, I'm running to the house, you know, I'm running to the house, and then I end up, the next place I end up is uh, hanging out with Beyonce. We hanging out, like, the whole, you know, whole time or whatever, kicking and having a good time, real good friends, and uh, getting along really well. And um, it's like... We come to this one place, and it's like the night is over, you know what I'm saying? So she like, shoot, she got to go home, everything, you know? You know, we was just having a good time. She, you know, we was like, all right, you know? I was like, bye, you know, have you know, have a good night, whatever, however it went. And uh, this other guy he was, that I was talking to, I was like, man, I was like, I think she likes me. I think I think she likes me. Uh, I, I, I thought that to myself. I was like, should I tell him that? I, I don't know. It seemed like she likes me. And, uh, you know, uh but I didn't say nothing. And then the other guy, he was like, yeah, he was like, yeah, that guy Rip Hamilton, he be, uh, he be acting kind of funny sometimes. He was acting, he be acting kind of, kind of funny sometimes. You know what I'm saying? I was like, I don't know what he was talking about, you know, when he said that. But he looked, the guy looked like Rip Hamilton, though. Rip Richard Hamilton, you know, UConn star, you know, um, Washington, a lot of, you know what I'm saying, baller, super, super, super shooter, you know, uh, Detroit, you know what I'm saying, baller. Yeah, but. Uh, yeah, he cold. Uh, to me, he nice. Um, but yeah, man. So yeah, so, so uh, 
So yeah, so I'm chilling talking to him, and then he telling me he said so. So the dude that looked like Rip Hamilton, but he talking about Rip Hamilton, he said, uh, man, he's like, yeah, she about to go, you know, get on her grind. I was like, huh? He like, yeah, man. He was like, yeah, that's what all these. He's like, that's what all these. Uh, Jay Z, he's like Jay Z, Jennifer Lopez, Mark Anthony, all them type people like that. You know what I'm saying? Like that's what they do. You know what I'm saying? They get on their grind. They go work hard. And they do what they do. That's what they do. They grind all the time. That's what they do. You know what I'm saying? That's what he was telling me, and uh, I was like, oh, already. You know what I'm saying? That's that's what I want to do. That's what I do. You know what I'm saying? Grind all day. That's what I want to do. You know what I'm saying? I ain't I ain't got there yet. I'm I need to get there. You know what I'm saying? And then all my fruit will produce, you know what I'm saying, but uh, it's it's got it's got to be done. So uh, so yeah, man. So so yeah, so that's what he like. Yeah, Jennifer Lopez. You like yeah, all of them. You know what I'm saying? That's what they do. You know. So when he started talking about Jennifer Lopez, I was like, dang, I had some dreams. You know what I'm saying about Jennifer Lopez too. You know what I'm saying? That I would hang out with her and be good friends with Jennifer Lopez. And, you know, I don't know if we was talking or whatever. Seemed kind of like it. You know, um, be honest, but we was cool, you know, real good friends. And um, like I said, I met her family and all that. But this, and this one, it's like, so when it went, so then I was like, man, I, I wonder if I should tell them about that. I had dreams about her too, you know, that I would meet her too. Uh, and then I was like, so and then I seen a vision while I was having a dream. I seen the vision of Jennifer Lopez, and she was in, in this garden. It was like a square pattern, it was like a picture. And it was like a square pattern, and it was like, you know, on the inside it had a circle of something, some, a circle of something, and um, it was Jennifer Lopez's estate, you know what I'm saying? It was like green, it was like beautiful, it was very, very beautiful, you know what I'm saying? Very, very beautiful, and I was like, dang, this is how rich people, you know what I'm saying? I was like, this is how rich people live, you know what I'm saying? It was just beautiful, you know what I'm saying? Like, it was just... A blessing it just felt like you know and that's what I that's what I seen and uh, I'm trying to think I think that's 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 about it you know what I'm saying that was the dream so you know I'm not gonna listen to anybody except for God and I know I can make it to where I need to be I just need to work hard keep praying and keep stay focused and do the right things and I'll get where I need to go you know I gotta be obedient so, I appreciate all y'all who stay tuned to this homemade documentary that God is letting me make. You know, I appreciate all of y'all that watch and support and ask questions and, you know, bless us and pray for us. You know, pray, pray for the Untouchables for Christ. I, we appreciate it, you know, and we always will. And uh, we're working until... Till it's till it's gone, till we till we taken up by Jesus Christ. That's when we, you know, and our work doesn't stop there. That's only the beginning, you know. Death at death, or the Lord taking us and, and uh, you know taking up taking us up in the rapture. That's only the beginning, you know. Life we live for it forever, you know. This is only a short time period compared to how long we're gonna live, you know, and be blessed forever. So. I just wanted to report that dream to y'all, you know, um, you know, times are changing. Like I said, I'm Neo. Got to save everybody. It's everybody in the system. I'm the one that stands out because I'm something not normal. I'm a being for Jesus that's not normal. That's what he continues to tell me. He continues to show me in my dreams that I'm flying. So many people talk about they have dreams, but, you know, I'll be flying like Superman or like Neo, like these type people, like saving people. And I have a lot of people to save, a whole bunch of people to save. So many people I've seen in my dreams, people's souls I have to save, all these people. So however God gets me there to meet these people and interact with these people and however it goes, you know, God uses everything in his plan. I mean, he doesn't commit evil, but it's in his system. I don't ask to sin. I never have, you know, but we're not perfect here on this earth. We're not perfect, you know, only God, Jesus, Jesus Christ, you know, Jesus Christ, who came as a man, 
but humbled himself, you know, humbled himself, came as a man. He was already God, you know, and the Son, God and the Son, you know what I'm saying? He's God the Father, and then the Son, Jesus Christ, you know, and the Holy Spirit, and, they were all, and the Holy Spirit is God also, so all three of them are God. And, uh, you know, I just want to tell y'all, you know, tell y'all about that dream and, you know, I keep having them, I keep having these dreams, especially about Beyonce and Jay-Z, I keep having these dreams. Mm -hmm. But God bless them and, you know, congratulations on them um, being pregnant, you know what I'm saying? That's, that's a blessing for real, you know, that's a real good blessing. So I pray that the baby be healthy and the baby be, you know. Just grow up to be tremendous worker for the Lord, you know, in Jesus' name. God bless y'all. I love y'all, man. Peace out.